Hello, and welcome to our fruit stamps project. For this project, you'll need acrylic paint, a sponge, paint breaths, a paintbrush, fruits, as well as a plate. Start by stamping using the sponge to stamp your sky. Start by adding a dark blue at the top, fading to white as we go down. Once you've covered the whole page, be sure to let it dry. Now it's time to add the stems for your flowers. Be sure that there are a variety of different heights. That way you can see all of the different flowers once you add them with your fruit. Use a slice of fruit or vegetable to add in your leaves. Here I'm using a slice of orange. Dip it in the paint and simply press down to make your different leaves. Then while the paint is still wet, add in your grass. Notice how my brush strokes are going upward to create the illusion that the grass is growing. Once you've added your grass, it's time to add our flower. Simply take your fruit or vegetable, I'm using a pepper, dip it in your paint, and rub it all along the surface of the paint so that the paint is evenly spread. Press down your fruit or vegetable at the top of your stem and you have your flower. Repeat this process as many times as you like. I'll be demonstrating two different kinds of flowers today. I'll be using a different kind of fruit to make a daisy. For this, I just simply sliced an orange in half to create the circle. Again, using a slice of fruit, I'm going to create the petals going around that center to create a, a radial design. At the very end, I want to go over that center one more time so that it stands out. And here we have our fruit stamps. Feel free to do this with a variety of different kinds of fruit and vegetables, creating different kinds of flowers. I can't wait to see your design and let me know if you have any questions.